Yes, good morning to you, Ali and James. Now, this five day show starts at 8 30 this morning for the public. There's some owners now uh, arriving, getting their dogs all set up. But I have Linda Rose with me again, the president of the Lebanon County Kennel Club. Linda, talk to me about this. I mean, enormous setup behind us. It is. It's very large. We have almost 5,000 dogs here. They come from all over. It's an international show. Um, what it is here, they've come in and set this all up last night. There will be more arriving today, uh, so the handlers are coming in now to let them outside. But we have a very big day in store. There's there's actually 17 dog shows, some shows within shows. So people have to get their dog all and proper and we also have um, a peewee competition this weekend we have canine good citizen testing we have trick testing there's a, a malamute weight pool that's happening um, plus we also have two group shows we have a working group show on saturday we have a sporting group show on sunday so there's a lot that's going on now as president of the lebanon county kennel club linda how does lebanon county represent during this international five day long show so we have the Thursday and Friday show, and Lebanon County has been part of this cluster since 1999. Now, Harrisburg Kennel Club and Mason-Dixon Kennel Club go years back. So I think here we've been here at this exact location for 30 years. So it's really quite phenomenal, and we've been one of the largest shows in the nation, actually. So it's, uh, it is very exciting, and people do come from all over, and it's a good competition. Now, we did talk about some of those competitions. Now, how are they judged? Because they're, they're judged pretty specifically. Well, some of, the dogs, some of the dogs are rare breeds. They're miscellaneous breeds. They're trying to get AKC recognized, but AKC has a standard that the mother club has written. And so when they look at a dog in the ring, it has to match that standard. And the one that comes closest to that standard, because no dog is perfect, comes closest to the standards one that's usually crowned. You know, best of breed, and then it goes on to the group shows. Thank you so much, Linda. Appreciate you being with us oh, again you. this morning. Allie and James, I'll send things back to you in the studio. Hopefully, coming up at 6, we'll get to see one of these dogs. But for now, live at the Farm Show Complex, Kayla Schmidt, ABC 27 News.